Hey guys, in this video I'll show you a quick walkthrough on how to make these wood stars. My kids have a school project where they need two stars, so I'll make two small ones and two big ones. The big ones are for a Christmas project later on this year, and I'll make these out of this pellet wood that I found. But if you want a bit more detailed information about angles and measurements, you gotta head over to another YouTuber and he's called Savvy Builds. There's a link below for his channel and definitely go check him out. He's building a lot of different stars. Anyway, let's get back to business and let's get started. Bots are ready, I just need to set up my drop saw. First couple of cuts are going to be 45 degrees. After the first cut, you want to make sure that it actually is 45 degrees. These pre-settings on the machines can be a little bit off, so you, you want to make sure that it's actually 45 degrees. Second cut, still 45 degrees, and the distance here to here is about 160 mil. I got five pieces out of the one board, so that's perfect. Next cut, it's a 31.5 degree cut, but I already have a pre-settings here at 31.6, so I'm hoping this will be okay. I mounted a stop at this end, and it's cut on a 45 degree angle. You simply just slide in the piece, and it's quite secured, and it helps me make the same cut every single time. I just want to mention that this feature right here on the Boss Drop Saw is absolutely brilliant. You can actually take this off and mount it on the other side if you want that. And no, I'm not sponsored in any way, but it would have been great though, but I don't think that they're going to spend money on a YouTuber with only 5,000 subscribers. Well, on that note, you might as well hit the subscribe button down below. Let's continue. How do we get the measurements from the stop block to the blade without doing any fancy measuring? Well, you just take your piece, flip it around, bring down the saw, and you want to have enough material right here to make the cut. Okay, let's see how we did. I'd say that's pretty good. I've done with the stars. I have to make a few more of these for the kids. But before I do the surface treatment, I want to do a chamfer all the way around for these. Let me show you. I've sanded all the pieces and now it's time to glue them together. I'll be using standard type on two and some super glue. First I add the super glue, and this is a thick version. I line them up. This is important. And slowly press them together until you get a nice squeeze out and you hold it for 15 seconds. And we simply just continue. Now for the last bit, I'm going to wait a few hours until the Type 1 2 has set. Right, the standard glue has done its job. It's all hardened, so now it's time for the last piece. go we'll let that dry up before we go any third all done now it's time for the service treatment we'll probably give it two to three coats next step is to give it a good sand and hopefully we'll get some clear lines I would say that looks pretty good, so I'm quite happy with the results. 
And next step will be some oil. It can be clear, any color you want. And now for all the danger oil. Now we're all done with the stars. I think they turned out pretty good. Please remember to subscribe and hit the like button below so you can follow me for more videos like this. I'll see you later in the next video.